Okay, so here's a tool we created for one of our clients. It's like a data analysis or custom reporting tool. You're looking at the results here. Each dot represents one store in a particular chain of stores around the US. So it's a good way to visualize where most of the stores are. Um, on the next tab, it's just a different way to display the same data. Um, it's just a concentration so you can get quantitative data. There's exactly 321 stores within 95 miles of Chicago, etc. So I'll show you the last tab. This is where the good stuff happens. Um, let's run another report while we're here. Let's look for a concentration of around 125 miles. So here you see the macro just counting up all the stores around these cities. Um, computers can make one trillion operations every second which needless to say that's a little bit faster than I can count okay so it looks like it just finished let's sort by the new column here look it's pretty interesting Chicago is the third largest city in the US so it has a lot of stores Tampa though 55th largest city has the second most stores so let's go take a look at the updated concentration map um, obviously the larger circles means that there are more stores within that area um, and this is just a good example of how you can visualize data in unique ways in Excel outside of your standard pie charts and your bar graphs. Also, this is a good example of how macros can create powerful, automatic, error-free reporting tools that can save you a ton of time.